she's Rachel, she's Mara, and, and welcome, welcome to, to our experiment. experiment. Today our experiment is called the fire resistant water balloon. And the materials we'll need are balloons, matches, and cold water. First we're going to show what will happen to the balloon without any water in it. <laughs> Make sure you have on your safety goggles. Tie this please. Of course. Okay. Step one is to light your match. Make sure you hold it a certain distance away from you. Step two is to hold the balloon above the light and slowly pull it down. It's going to be loud. <laughs> Make sure you put the wick in wet water, or cold water. <coughs> now we're going to show what we're going to do with the balloon with the water. Oh, crap. <laughs> we're going to fill it with water until it gets to the skinny part of the balloon. And then we're going to blow it up. Okay. Make sure you securely tie it. You're going to do the same with this balloon. First you light your match. And then slowly lower it. As you can see, the balloon has not popped. Now we're going to actually pop the water balloon. Oh. We should get paper towels. <laughs> Oh, no, not yet. <laughs> mm -hmm. If you can see it, the light is actually leaving black marks onto the place with the water. It's soot built up from the carbon stored in the balloon from the flame. And if you move it to a different side of the balloon, it will pop. Well, hopefully this taught you what you can do with a balloon. And if you ever try to do it, make sure you have adult supervision. We hope you liked this experiment. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and hit the like button and be sure to subscribe to this channel. Bye. Bye. -bye.